remember when you said it doesn't get better than this. Only a fool to let you go. It got into my head. Am I about to lose myself? When will all of this fade away? 'Cause I see colors for the first time. I'm starting to. Aston Martin DB12 Volante, new super tourer car with open roof. Aston Martin recently revealed to the public its latest car that carries the world's first super tourer concept, the DB12 at the Quail, a motorsports gathering at Monterey Car Week. The latest model from Aston Martin comes in the Volante variant, which takes the exquisite design from its coupe sibling, but with an open roof that can give unlimited sensations. The fixed metal roof has been replaced by an elaborate fabric roof with eight layers of insulation to keep the cabin quiet during the long journeys typically made by Grand Tourer (GT) cars. From the company's release, August 14th, it is known that this roof can be folded in 14 seconds when the car is traveling at speeds of up to 50 kilometers per hour, and takes 16 seconds to climb back up. Interestingly, this roof can also be controlled from outside the car using a key, as long as the owner is within two meters of the car. This roof can even be operated when the car faces strong winds of up to 50 kilometers per hour. The DB12 Volante will be sold with a standard black roof, but customers can also order a red, blue, or black, silver roof in a variety of other exterior and interior color options. What's more, customers can order special touches from the Q by Aston Martin department, which is responsible for creating cars that are highly customized according to the wishes of money buyers. Like the Coupe, this 2 plus 2 convertible relies on a 4.0 liter twin turbo V8 engine capable of producing 671 horsepower of power and 800 newton meters of torque. Only a fool to let you go. You got into my It only takes 3.7 seconds to reach 100 kilometers per hour from rest, making it only one tenth of a second slower than the standard coupe version. With a top speed reaching 325 kilometers per hour, this car still provides extraordinary performance. Power is directed to the wheels via an eight-speed automatic transmission located at the rear, which works together with an electronic limited rear differential and a carbon fiber prop shaft. Braking is regulated by a 400 millimeters front disc and a 360 millimeters rear disc, which are installed as standard. However, Aston Martin also offers the option of an optional carbon ceramic brake kit, which reduces weight by up to 27 kilograms. The DB12 Volante also features 21-inch wheels reinforced with customized Michelin Pilot Sport 5 tires. I don't see the fire in your eyes, wondering what I've done wrong. Those words are kind of hard to find, so I just had to write this song. I don't want to see you cry again, and no matter how the story ends, I'll always be there for you. 'Cause I see colors for the first time. I'm starting to realize nothing's ever black and white, and I'm caught up in the first night. Now it doesn't feel right. I'll just have to. Just like the coupe, the DB12 Volante has a new infotainment system from Aston Martin with a 10.25-inch touchscreen that supports Android Auto and Apple CarPlay connectivity wirelessly. This multimedia system is equipped with conventional controls for frequently used functions, including heating and ventilation. Audio enthusiasts can upgrade a standard 11-speaker sound system with 390 watts to a 15-speaker Bowers and Wilkins setup with 1,170 watts. 
This luxury car is estimated to be sold from US$265,000 or more than US$4 billion. Indonesian rupees. The Aston Martin DB12 Volante will enter production in the third quarter of this year. The first deliveries to customers are scheduled to be made in the fourth quarter of 2023.